Hello everyone, I know you want us to go in order for the audios, but we'll watch that after this. I'm probably not going to pay attention. Anyway, you ready, Fable? This is Yee. Hunter the Parenting. Chapter 3, Hunter's Hunts Hunted. I think that's a play on Ed and Eddie, but I'm not sure. Twice bitten, once shy. Okay, I'll make sure I get one ready for you before that time, Daisy. Arc 1, Part 3 or 3. Uncle Marcus let loose a cannibal in my house. I just want to sleep. Sweep. Is that kid? Yeah, that's probably boy. Boy. Cool. Ooh. If if Big D is such an amazing hunter, why is he scared? Why can't he just defeat it instantly? Probably because uh, vampires like this is unpredictable. I mean, I, I'm hearing excuses. I'm oh not seeing results. <laughs> oh my god, Fable. We haven't even started the video. <laughs> I'm hearing excuses. <laughs> I'm not seeing results, chat. That's all I'm saying. Anyway. And he can turn invisible. Marcus, you do not let vampires diablerize each other unless you know exactly what you are doing. How the fuck was I supposed to know? Oh, How many this is times bad. Must I tell you, son? Playing God is a sometimes thing! <laughs> Coming from Big E, I don't want to fucking hear that. <laughs> Playing God is a sometimes thing? Yeah, I don't want to hear that from Big D at all. I love it. Shush! What? Be silent! Oh. oh. He could be anywhere. Because he can turn invisible. Fuck. Hey, yeah, this is really bad. Piotr, you know, your name's like wrong. It's the Slavic version of Peter, but pronounced phonetically. Boy. The Slavic version of Peter, huh? Bad. Yes, it is. Of course the little kid is freaking out. What are you doing? If he's strong enough to make Dad sweat, then it's silly to fight him here. True. Come on, he's an ambush predator. If we get him outside, he'll have to fight us out in the open. Marcus, Marcus, it's two stories. Don't... Oh, oh! Ah! Fuck my legs! Gable, he just jumped down two stories. Listen, Magnus has never been smart. I I, I see your point. <laughs> he looks like a dying Marcus, fish. Be quiet! I fucked up my ankle. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, There's a difference between a good hunter and a fuck, and a fuck super gorilla polar bear. I'm I'm all I'm hearing is excuses, no results, chat. Uh, Oh, also, he was head first. How did he mess up his legs? I don't know. I think he tried to land like somersault style and broke his legs. Marcus, take this gun. Oh, it will protect you. What? Oh, oh, okay, okay. okay throw it to me. Okay. I am dropping it now. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, it went through both of his legs. John, that is very bad. Yes, it is. Marcus, you can. Try and make it for the road. It is safer there. You, close the office door. Then uh, we will know if he gets in. That is a good, uh, good okay. point. Actually, the problem is I'm pretty sure he's already in there with them. He might be for all we know.
Just do it real fast. Oh. <sighs> Seems to be fine. We cannot remain here. No, you can't. What are you planning? I will saw a hole in the wall here. What? Why? Anyway, we can make it out onto the carport roof and jump from there. It is far safer. That's my son. As canny and practical as the old mind. I just want to say something real quick, actually. Okay. When you're dealing with a when you're dealing with a predator that can essentially become invisible, the best thing you can do, in my honest opinion, the best thing you can do in your honest opinion is to try to hide hide in your senses, as in look, as in try to feel if anything feels off. There's a reason. There's a reason we feel like something is watching us. I understand that it's kind of impossible when you're really scared. However, if they're worth any, if they're worth any, like, if they're worth their salt, they'll realize that something's off in the room. I'm you know not, what I mean? I'm not sure if that's actually a thing where being watched is actually, like, something you can really tell. But he's also someone who likes to play with his food, so you also Problem. have to be aware of that. Problem is this: if I know if he is wants to play with his food, he's not in the room with them. He's making them believe that they're in the room. I see, basically making you think that he thought that he thought to go to her home. Anyway. Yes, predators love to predators that love to play with their food will let you stew in fear for as long as possible. Yeah, I've seen cats do it to mice. I shall Sadly, end. yes. Oh, he's got a sword. Can you really do it fast enough? Yes. Father. <gasps> Father. Oh my ass! Oh. <laughs> he's crawling on the wall! Out of here. Okay. They need to go. I told you it wasn't gonna work. Go and take care of father. I have old mining equipment that can help us. Got it. Oh. I'm going for the carport. Go, go, go. Don't forget the car keys, fool. <gasps> oh! Holy oh, moly. He threw a car at him. Of course he did. God damn. <laughs> God damn, you got lucky that it just hit the doorway. Oh god. He is right behind you. Maybe. Oh, I don't like how clever you are. Hmm. There he is! That was a smart move throwing That was a smart move throwing the shoe though. Oh What is time to make trap hole? You should have taken my offer, lover boy. Oh, he's much bigger. He's got yellow eyes now. I feel like I've seen this character before. I wonder why. Mm, maybe. Now you're dead and buried. Well, just buried for now. Mm. Don't worry. I'll be right with you. What? He turned into a cat. What the hell? Natural cat. Weirdo. Ugh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. Hell yeah. Uh. Fable, what is he doing? I'm. I'm not sure. He's on stilts now. I know he is. I'm not sure what he's doing, actually. I knew these would come in handy! I've always wanted to walk on stilts, Whoa. but I've always been scared to. Why didn't you go for the road? I couldn't just leave Dad. Why are you on still fucking hell? I would. Do it leaves dad the dad behind? Yeah. He does seem to have a head wound. Oh. And again, the stilts. Very uh, distracting. He, he's in the workshop. Hold on. What are you doing? Stop! <laughs> Wait, you're gonna... Oh! Let me get this straight. 
You're leaving your family behind to make an escape on fucking stilts? Maybe. Hmm. I can run faster than a car and leap <laughs> Maybe. I do like that he just gives him a maybe. Like nothing. I mean, he thought about it. <laughs> fuck you! <laughs> just like, fuck you! Runs away on stilts. An angry a very fable thing. Predictable vampire. If I attack without thinking. He's thinking, fable. He's learning. Yeah, he's not learning. What do you mean he's not? He's not. Man, today is just not your lucky day. Fuck you! Wrong answer. Oh. Ooh. Wait! Stop! Wait! Stop! Well, I was gonna ease up, but if you insist. Oh, God damn. In such a sweet sorrow. He's having a little too much fun with this, huh? He is. He really is. <sighs> yeah, like I said, he likes to play with his food. But don't worry. I'll take my time just for you. You are truly... As pathetic as they come. Thanks, love. I try. No! Oh. You're truly pathetic! Oh. You talk of it again, but you're nothing and you know it. Back in the tunnels, your first target was a child. And while you were getting your shit pushed in, your friends did all the hard work. How did you repay them? Moralizing over that death gauntlet. Oh. You were their leader! If you gave a shit, you could have stopped it. You didn't even try. Damn. Instead, you hid. Oh. You had something to gain, so you ran away while your friends tore each other apart. It was survival of the fittest. Bullshit. They were your comrades. Oh. And you smiled, you bastard. You smiled while you murdered people dumb enough to accept you. Fable, uh, what did you think of that? It's true, but... At the same time, um, uh, not gonna lie, he's getting mad for the wrong reason. What do you mean? I mean, he's getting mad over something <laughs> over a creature that doesn't really matter. I mean, I I, again, I don't care for vampires. So no, I, want think, I think he wants him to strike a nerve with him. He's not. He's doing it in the wrong way, sadly. I really pissed me off. It did? Yeah, it clearly did. Oh! Oh! Gentlemen! He's clearly angry about it. You seem to have difficulty understanding that I'm the goddamn Sephiroth. Thank you for the bless you. shame. Human weaknesses. I am beyond human. You're I not really. Want, and I take it. No, I you are so it human. It's actually pathetic. Me. I am the sword of Cain, you wretch. And you I are not. Fall where I please. No. Uh, oh. Well then. And that's where the stilts came in. What did you think that was, Fable? Interesting. Uh, just want to say this. Um, here, here's a tip. When pissing off a super powerful creature, make sure they don't have the ability to kick someone at you. Trust or me, you I do it all the time. I do it all the time when it comes to video games and other players in video games. You gotta know when to piss people off. Mm -hmm. Shit beer, <laughs> day of death. Uh, or, go ahead. Just, um... Seriously, just piss them off when it's when you have full control, not when they can literally kick the kick the body of your of your loved one at you. Let's see, shitbeard cause death. Let's see, June nineteen ninety five cause the king's 
College Bikers for Blood donation drive. Disappearances of... Oh! You disappeared there a blood drive. A, uh, let's see. Cause That's, of death. Uh... Hitting the head with a shovel. Put in a mass grave. But yeah. I just want to say, I just want to say, really, guys, really, vampires stealing from a blood do stealing, kidnapping from a blood donation? Are, are, this is basic stuff, and it's very, very like you know, like I, I don't know what's the word I'm looking for. Predictable. Yeah, yeah that's it. All right, right. Piotr, cause underwater welder embraced by a for. A workforce superior during an underwater sabot operation. Underwater welders are wow. They're a scary job, actually. A lot of things yeah. can go wrong. Yeah. I just want to say this. Uh, I think vampires are incredibly boring creatures. So if that bothers you. I'm sorry. This is just my opinion. The sabot section is wrong. The Sabbat section within the Vampire Society see themselves as the chosen of the first of Cain. First vampire Cain. The biblical figure cursed by the Old, Te Old Testament God. They genuinely believe themselves to be part of a great crusade against the, an the ancient Antediluvians, the Grand Charter of Cain, the founder of the clans, and the traitors of Cain's purity. In truth, however, they are often just a bunch of random people forced into a war they barely understand ushered like lemmings toward violence, inhumanity, and final death. Yeah. That sounds about right. They literally tried to find meaning in their now horrible lives, so their one thing is, I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna fight in this war that I have no place in, really. What are your thoughts, Fable? They believe they're in a holy war. Yeah. Fable, are you alright? Uh, yeah, sorry, I was talking to my mom. Uh, like I said, uh, vampires, no matter the clans, are boring. Mm. Listen, if you guys are in a if you guys, um, have heat over souls or have vampire characters, I'll power to you. I just think that they're very predictable. Boring. Oh. <laughs> You're welcome. Oh, he lost a leg! <laughs> Fucking minefield in your own front lawn. <laughs> that is insane. <sighs> is it? Is this? Is this Big D? Did he do it? Probably. It sounds like something he'd do. It probably did. I am beyond hey, human, but not beyond rage. You little pricks! You'll die screaming. Blank body. Oh, Fable. Yeah. How does it feel? That's an MDI suit, if I remember correctly. U.S. Army. Bomb disposal unit. Yeah. Yeah, I can tell. Is this what he meant when he said his old mining days? It's possible. It is possible that Dor was actually part of the army. Yeah. It's a special... Like, the army has special units for everyone in different, like, corps that you join to, like, take on specific, like, things, if you know it, what I mean. Yeah. It also would probably explain why they have landmines. They need a demolition expert, and I'm sure Dor is that demolitions expert. Hmm. Being prey again. Prey? <laughs> You uh, think now's the time right, to, go to sleep, jokes. sweet bunny. Good night, sweet bunny. Do you think I'm joking? Wait, what did he say back there? Yeah. Each you. Oh. How does it feel being prey again? Prey! Oh. <laughs> Damn it, me. You think now's the time to crack jokes? Do you think I'm joking? Hunter Bravado! Your dime a dozen trash! This shit'll heal in a heartbeat! 
Too bad you don't have a heartbeat. Uh, there Damn. you go again. Stick up the ass Ventrue material. <laughs> You're even the last man standing. You and the kid. That's rich. But your jacket won't save you. He doesn't need to save me. Just slow you down. That is a hell of a line. Oh yeah. And he's right, he doesn't need to save him. He just needs it to slow you down long enough for him to get a shot off. Good night, sweet oh, Daisy. Yeah. We'll see about that. You interrupting our moment. I know what you're thinking. You know with that busted leg, you can't reach me in time. Oh. But you're thinking maybe, maybe, maybe you can jump over. Jump over these mines. Get to me before I pull the trigger. Maybe you can, but maybe you can't. Maybe my gun finds you. And maybe the force of a 45 caliber bullet sends you plummeting straight to hell. Me? I like those odds. But you, you have an eternity to lose. So the question is, you want to live forever, son? That's a pretty good line. Oh, yeah. This this voice actor is just wonderful at his job. Like, uh... I, I yeah. He's thinking about what to do. Because if he makes that leap, Dorn is going to shoot him immediately. Dorn has him... <laughs> I'd rather measure the dent in your skull, shovelhead! Oh! Not there, Dorn. Oh! <laughs> Die, Hunter! No. Oh. Oh! Fable! It'll all be over soon. Yeah? The boy shot him. <laughs> God damn. I mean, I, I mean, yeah, of course he did. Where do you think Boy was this entire time? They really were ready for him in all ways here, huh? Oh. I don't remember. Wanna die? Remember, Mac. The suit isn't there to keep. The suit wasn't there to keep him alive. It was just there to slow him down. But you did a job. Yeah. He thought he stunned him long enough to put him down, but he didn't. And he said the most human words he could at the very end, huh? Listen to the immortal words of Frieza from the Abridged series. Like a bitch. Yes! Oh, I knew you were a good shot. I knew you it's, were! It's like death match mm -hmm. in real life. Okay. <laughs> Taking back my descent. Regarding planting mines on my front lawn now. Ow. Uh, <laughs> she dead? No, I think passed out or. Uh, He's or as close to dead as he's gonna be for a while. Yes, good. My head hurts and my legs. Can you hold me? Oh, <laughs> okay, just put I, me there. <laughs> I believe what Father is trying to say is we win. I, I finally helped. Holy guacamole. <laughs> I'd say you Aww. did more than help, boy. You saved the day. I shot a bitch. Take pride <laughs> in your accomplishments, boy. <laughs> we are all very proud of you. I have a concussion. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you just love boy? <laughs> boy is great. I still think... I still think... Big, uh, big D's useless as crap right now, okay? Uh, boy, I am super proud of you too, but, uh, should we call an ambulance? We can't do that! Cops? Not until that thing is dead! No cops! It will be, uh, boy. Sun's rising.
And so he's finally truly dead. Marcus. Man, are you gonna lecture me right now? I know the window is a bad idea, but please. You should come with me to the ring. Oh. Right. Maybe if you play Gmail mm. class. Aw, that's sweet. Fine. Oh my god, yeah. I can't <laughs> wait to show off the Hover Tub house. The Eternal Kleiner Death Machine. And boy, you've done so well today. As a reward, I will bake you a cake. Aww. Any flavor of meat you want, son. Medicine for days, yes. Oh, well Medicine for days. <laughs> Apparently he likes deer meat a lot. Yeah, that is... Yeah. Yeah, Sorry. okay. Who's up for some ambulance? Uh, oh, yeah. Are, are you good, Grapey? You should taste my teeth! Oh, back to Damn. Yeah, he's you know fine. What? Getting my ass beat makes me hungry. Let's go eat some cream crackers. That'd be all right. Yeah. An ambulance? Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, you know, I actually have a house alarm that calls 999 when... Oh. The cops are here. Oh. Shit. That's not. Still, Fable, I have to ask, what did you think of Hunter the Parenting, the first arc? Um, outside of the vampires, I kind of like the characters. They're interesting. The one thing I um, will say about uh, Hunter the Reckoning, from what I know, is you're not just fighting um, vampires, you're fighting all sorts of supernatural stuff. Because, you know... Everything, including vampires, is there. Werewolves, fae, other kinds of gross cryptids trying to murder you, secret societies, ghosts. Anyway, more words, Fable? Uh, I still think Big D was useless. I'm trying to be rude, but le legitimately. This leads to second best audio. Well, we'll watch that eventually. I'm just glad Fable's having fun with this. Is there actually more onto the parents either? Yes. Okay. There's some audio logs, and I think the next episode of the next arc is up. I will say, they put a tremendous amount of effort in this, and it really shows. Like, they seem to have kept just their old team and made this, and it works out wonderfully. Yeah. All the voice well, actors... Oh, go ahead. Well, Common, let's make you a cake. Any meat flavor you want. I feel like you're now going to start quoting this series a bit, but we'll see that later. Not really. We'll see that later. A return for Arc 2. Is there an Arc 2? I feel like that's lies. Why do you feel like that's lies? I can't decide between P for venison. Tell me. We can make both of them if you want. That'd be weird. I've never had a meat cake or a meat pie, and I kind of don't want to. It sounds kind of gross. Alright, so we're getting common both cow meat and venison meat. <laughs> what? Oh, what's this? Where the oh. Hell am I? Oh, I think he's in hell now. Mm. Oh. Greetings, Peter! Welcome to fucking hell! <laughs> well then. That was weird. Apparently he went to hell. I mean, yeah, he was kind of a dick. It's kind of funny that uh, it seems Shitbeard went to heaven and he went to hell. <laughs> I wonder 
know why he went to heaven. He probably wasn't nearly as bad as Piotr was. Yeah. So, all vampires are cursed to go to hell. Oh. Well, that sucks. Anyway, thank you all so much. If you like what we're doing here, please do consider following. We'll, I'll be glad to watch more of this. And Fable, I'm glad you're having a fun time with us here on our journey through World of the Darkness. I still think vampires are boring. I know you do, buddy. I know you do. You won't stop telling me this. Anyway. As for all you wonderful people, thank you all so much. And I'll see you later. Have fun, guys. Bye.